Hello, and welcome to this Fallout 4 settlement tour. This is Extreme Wackazoid, and today we are looking at Green Top Nursery. This is on the PS4. I'm using a number of mods, which are listed below. I have minigun turrets and heavy laser turrets, and I have them raised up on these ball track supports with a wooden, uh, small wooden uh, block there, and I raise them up high so that they're protected from melee attackers. One of the first things that I do when I build is I decide where I'm going to put my power source. And I typically put it up high. I definitely protect it. And so my power source is up there. It's surrounded by concrete. And I do that because attackers will target your power source. And so with that, they'd pretty much have to hit it with a grenade. One of the things I wanted to do with this original structure is to patch up the roof. Uh, and so I wanted to have a, a, a roof that goes directly over the original roof um, and so I wanted it to be a little less clear of where the original began and mine started um, but uh, this is as close as I could get it really and if you're having trouble with that what you can do is just kind of build the whole thing and then use the select all trick with um, maybe a concrete pillar or something like that or one of these wooden posts and then you can kind of shimmy it around uh, until it fits to your liking. And so I'll show you the other side of this as well. So I fit some um, barn door posts there so it looks like it is actually being supported by something. The difficulty with that structure is there's a little bit of a chimney right there if you see it. And so what I did there is I just left that little space open. Uh, so that way there's a warehouse uh, floor right next to it that goes along with these roofs um, to leave that space open for the chimney and so I'll show you what I did with this original structure uh, what I did here was uh, just put some restrooms in here so there's a sink a shower and a toilet uh, surrounded by these bathroom stalls with some lighting and that's just, just about as much as I could fit inside there and then inside here is my residences. I just have about eight settlers. It's just the efficient number. It's three farmers, four vendors, and a provisioner. And so here's my residences. So this is one of those home in the future skins uh, for this building. And so I use this institute bedding to kind of go along with that um, look and maybe the color scheme as well. And I fit some tables and chairs here and settlers will come and hang out and look out these windows. And so what I wanted to do with Green Top Nursery, it is a nursery and there's a, it's one of the few structures with a greenhouse. And so I wanted to continue on with the greenhouse and make it less obvious where the original greenhouse ended and where my structure began. And if you see any of my other videos, you'll notice kind of a theme with that. That's something I definitely like to do. And so I, that's the original structure. And then I continued on with this uh, for my vendor stands. And again, if you're having trouble with that, what you can do is just kind of build the whole thing and then use the select all trick to kind of move it around and then fit it uh, exactly right. Um, I'm not going to lie, it is difficult because that's got to make sure it's not clipping into that wall and will actually, um, you know, go green and, and be able to place it like that. And so. My settlers are growing mute fruit. It's efficient number. Uh, it's efficient food to grow, and I gave them all these laundered green dresses. I like to give them all the same outfits, so it looks like they're in some kind of cult or something. It's kind of creepy, and I gave them ballistic weave and their clothing and their hats as well. And with the men, I gave them these uh, mechanics outfits. It's the green version of the mechanics, and uh, so they're farming inside the actual greenhouse there. And so here's my other vendor stands. I definitely like to have a restaurant area because they will come and congregate here and it looks like they're ordering food and then they'll come and hang out here after work. And so I want it to look like a functioning restaurant with some cabinetry there, a oven, a sink, a refrigerator. And with my general store vendor, uh, it's a tier three vendor stand. I place items in the stands there. Uh, so it looks like they're actually selling something and with the shelving I build the shelving out into like an empty space 
and then I raise and lower the shelving with the select all trick and then I use the OC decorator mod to place items and then I bring the shelf all the way back uh, with the select all trick again um, and I wanted this to be floored and I wanted the flooring to go uh, directly into the dirt um, and so this is a lot of different wooden materials I like it to look kind of junky so it looks like they actually did just grab some scrap and and build with it and so this is a clothing vendor I like to use these armor stands to look like they're actually selling clothing and here's the clinic vendor with like a gurney and a light and things like that with some medical supplies being sold so here's the the other side of that greenhouse structure so that's what I did with Green Top Nursery uh, if you like what you see you can hit like and you can uh, favorite the channel as well. Thank you.